All right, um, this is Connor R. from Angling North here, and uh, I'm going fishing tomorrow morning. So we're just out in my front yard, and I'm looking for some worms. I already gathered a few last night. Uh, I caught two salamanders, so that's a bonus. Um, so, yeah, let's, I just wanted to show you how we catch night crawlers around here. It's pretty darn easy, so let's do this. So what you're going to do is it's, what time is it right now? Just past 11, and what I'm doing is, it's not exactly perfect weather today, but yesterday it had just rained, which is perfect for them. They love coming out after the rain, and what you're going to want to do is step slowly as possible. And you see that one there? What you're going to want to do is grab for the lightest part, which I don't know where it is. I'm just going to grab it and slowly pull it out. And there we go, that's a night crawler. And I can actually see another one right there. And there we go. See, that's how quick they are. You would never think that a darn worm could be so quick. So what we're going to do is we're going to go over to our little sour cream container full of worms and chuck him in there and put the lid back on we'll look at that carpenter ant we boat on the road on the way in here's our first issue I kind of don't have a seat I'm just gonna be sitting on there not bad but not the best all right Connor and here we got five fish so far one on the fly and four on the troll. We're just using wedding bands, worms, and gang trolls. I got a willow leaf. My grandpa's got a kokanee troll. And for once, my grandpa's out fishing me with three and a nice 19 incher. Uh, he's gotten more hits, I would say. We're just waiting. all our fish right here which you probably can't see because it's heavy but there's a, five fish on there uh, I'm going to chuck this hood on but no we've been trolling and right now we're in 40 feet of water and we're about 10 feet down and that's where we're getting all our bites We've been out, it's 12.32, we've been out for, we're averaging 2.2 catches an hour because we're out here for, been out here for 2.3 hours. What? No, I accidentally stopped it. Edit. Gosh darn it. Can I start up again? No, I accidentally stopped it. Stopped it. So let's just resume previous check. Track my room catches. Here we go. We're back on to what we should be on. So I'm using the MyCatch app. Should probably get off that page. Might show flakes. Yeah, two hours, fifteen minutes. We've been catching fish the whole day. We've had some nice ones jumping. We were out here last week and had no luck really. Well, we caught I caught two fish on the fly. I had a nice one on trolling. My grandpa got a nice one on trolling. Or no, he did. We didn't get any on trolling, but he got a bunch of bites. Uh, let's see. Oh, that was a nice one. I'll keep going that way. We got a 
roast beef sandwich from my local gas station. It's finally time to eat. Anyways, I didn't really get much of a chance to show you guys the fish. There we go. Five fish. One nice one. Up. Yeah, one nineteen. There is a fish. Yep, yeah, right about eleven feet. So maybe anchor out here. I think. Yep. Yeah. Without losing my net, that would be nice. There, we've got extra line too. And I'll kind of just let do its thing. So here's the fly that I caught the fish on. It's a little jig micro leech, size 12. It's a 1 point or 1 8 bead. What the hell? I literally just had. I didn't. That's okay. Don't worry about it. That's a nice fish. I saw a nice fish, bro. Yeah, I, so did I. A really nice fish, geez. I think that's better than the one you lost. Yeah, he is. I did not mean to catch this fist at all. That was a fish. No, there's no loons close to us right now. Ooh, come on. That's Ooh, that's up there with that one I caught. You're going to have to measure that one, buddy boy. New PB? Your new PB, for sure. On the mu- Holy shit, that's a nice fish. Oh, look at the colors on that beauty. I'm gonna have to add the catch. Skip rainbow trout. You thought it was bigger. Uh, Silly grandpa. Nice fish, I don't think it was as big as that one. Oh no. I don't know, five feet away from the boat, not even. It was really just dangling over the side. So hell, that's what I'm gonna do again, just dangle it over the side. Right here on top of my line. Oh. I'm gonna bonk it first, then I'm gonna give you my rod to take a picture with it. I mean my, yeah, my phone. And that one's up there, buddy boy. That one is up there. Isn't it? I have it right here. It fell off. 
No, yeah, it does need to be measured. Tied with mine. I think we got two 19 inch fish. Yep. Well, that's a new PB for me, anyways. Two 19s. Both 19s. That means we can catch more of these boys. Anyways, that's still a hell of a new PB. Zipper mouth plague, that's a new one. And that I do, Grandpa. Bumper, no, come on. Away from the anchor, away from the anchor. Away, 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 away. There we go. It's nice. Ah, uh, that's pretty big. Not small. Not giant, but nice. Most of them in this lake are. Well, now you've caught more than me. I was just. I was hooked up with another nice one while trolling. See if I can multitask. Oh, I'm in your line. Yeah, I guess. No, I'm not. Beauty. That's up there with the 19 inch ones, buddy. Hell yeah, there we all go. Alright, alright. <laughs> well, this has been the best day of fishing since we've moved, no doubt. And look at that, we turned us right around doing that. No wonder you got hooked up. That's a nice fish, holy schmoly. I don't know if it's the 19, but it's up there. need one more then we can kind of focus on fly fishing a bit probably bumped into the motor Try to keep your fish on the one side of the boat. Oh yeah. And I think I ended up going in a circle. Well, that might be up. That might be. It's eighteen, nineteen, I'd say. Well, it's up there. It could be. I'd it's say that's eighteen. Close, right? that's close. Eighteen. Eighteen. One hell of an eighteen, though. Well, that's another dark one. So the two big dark ones are yours. It's not very dark. Not that it matters. We're gonna split the fish evenly. Yeah. Do I have numbers on? Yeah. Okay, it didn't die in that fight. Isn't it funny when we talk negative about something, then that something happens. Yeah, that's that's how it goes, right? Yeah. When you're talking, when you're not catching them. I would say this is our most even day yet. It's been a good day. It's been fairly consistent. Even though there's not a lot of jumpers, but there's some. Yeah. It's been a really good day. Alright, anyways. 
So you know what I gotta do? Gotta take a picture for the app. Oh, and this one might be picture worthy too. Find a uh... hell yeah, there goes my grandpa. Do I still have numbers? Yeah. Oh, so I caught one of yours on video too now. Come here, big boy. Come here, piggy boy. Come here, buddy. I seen a decent flash. Oh, that's a nice fish. Come here. This is almost the double header we were asking for. Come here. Come here. Come here. That's up there too. It's maybe 16. What do you think? No, I'd say yeah. Oh, mother. And. Well, that's fun. You didn't tie it that well and it came off? That's yours and it broke in there, yeah. How did we fix that? And your wedding band's completely apart. Oh. So, you have more of those, right? You might want to put a different one on. You know how to put it on. No, you have more of those kokanee trolls, right? Yeah, well, we're done. Well, we're limited out, yeah, but might as well put another one on so we could keep fishing and do I some catch. this one fixed. We're not fixing it on the water, no. No, well, not now. Well, I'll see if we didn't lose... You lost most of the beads because they're small enough to oh, fit. okay. I don't know what we got. I'm just wondering how you hook it onto here. Here, we'll get... You have to... Ah, uh, we'll see. Oh, this is broken. Yeah. I'm going to say 17 on that. Oh, this is part of... Okay. This is not part of the kokanee troll. It's part of the... Uh, oh, that's the wedding band part. Wedding band. Okay, well, that's okay. Yeah. I will say this one's 17. Yeah, it's up there, eh? Yeah. Most definitely is. But Five no. each. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Well, I found the hook. I want that hook back. It's in there pretty good. So all I got to do is put another wedding band on this thing, right? Huh? Yep. There's the hook. Um, I'm going to bonk this. Then I'll take a picture of our, pretty much, I'll call it a double header for the picture. Nice double header to finish the limit, eh? What time is it? 2.16. Oh, I have... Four, four and a half hours. That's pretty darn good. That's a fish every half hour. Yeah. We have a fish on. And we still do. He's just right behind us. Oh, he's just a little gaffer. You want him netted? And then you can release him? Yep. Little bastard put the hook in my net. Fish off? Yep. It seems like this is going to take me a second, so. Here comes my grandpa with a nice fish. A really nice one. I'm getting hits. He's pulling. 
He's a big, he's a big fish. Pulling on the drag. He really is, yeah. Oh, I'm getting hit. Yeah, that's what all fish do. That's a nice fish. Holy shit. Yep. I was casted right beside my grandpa's. Here's another one on the fly. Oh, this one might be nice. Sure is acting like it. Oh. Just don't want them to go near anchor lines. Oh yeah. You know it is. Oh, that guy. Not at all. So about what, 16 maybe? 16 and 16 to 17 area. Reels digging into my thigh. Look at the bend in that rod. He's a fighter. He's a nice fish. Trolling my style. <laughs> yeah, my grandpa's very odd style. <laughs> yeah, it works. And I got two bites doing it, so. Now you're one fish up on that. Now you gotta go back to trolling. Put her in the water. Oh hell, I'd be happy with that. I'm happy with what we have. Oh, I'm happy with what we have too. He's off. All right, here we are. That's all our fish. Here's the first one. All those bugs flying around are caddisflies. Here you go. We got buck 285 knife. And what you're gonna do is first, and this is all pollen, by the way. And without that fish getting away from you, because it's slippery, what you're going to do, if you can see this, is you're going to get under, up in between there. So you've created a cut right there. You're going to go up the vent. Then we're gonna go over here because there's less whatever. Shove your finger in there. And you're gonna want to get a good grip on the head. And you're just going to pull. So there's all your guts. And you just chuck them. And you take the fish. And you can see, that's a lot of blood. And you can see the bloodline here. Just going to run your thumb along there. And you're just going to give it a good old washout. Right there. And there's, and that 
is how you got a fish. Now I have a bunch more to do. So I'll just put that right there and get